in this video, we'll take a look at privacy settings and how to make sure that you can access photos and the camera in different apps and in Safari. First, we're going to go to our settings app. Next, we're going to scroll down on the left side. We're going to be finding privacy. When I tap on privacy, it gives me a a lot of different options. The first place I want to check is the Photos app. Here it'll show me all the different things I'm using on my iPad and it will allow me to make sure that I have turned on the Photos access to the ones that I need. For example, here my Schoology app says that no access is given or no permission has give, been given to use photos within the Schoology app. I'm going to tap on none and I'm going to change that to all photos. Sometimes when I open an app or a tool on my device, it gives me a pop-up that asks me to allow photos. If I say no, this privacy area is a way to help turn it back on. This also works for microphone access, as well as camera access for apps that have cameras. Next, I'm going to scroll down the left side and go to Safari. From time to time, we use Safari in order to access different websites for learning. If I scroll, to privacy and security, I can check things about my privacy, but I'm going to go right underneath that and look at settings for website. What I want to do is tap into the camera. I want to say allow or ask. Make sure that setting is on one of those. I can do that as well for the microphone in Safari. That's how to take a look at privacy settings on your learner's iPad.